and welcome back to my channel. Today is a bit of a different video. It's actually my first ever Q&A on my channel. Oh, nice. My first ever Q&A. We haven't done this sit down video for the longest time. For the longest time. I but there is an update on our side and that is that we are no longer, I'm not no longer a spinster and he's no longer a bachelor. Every time we have to fill out those government forms, we now have to tick Marie. Marie. <laughs> Crazy. I so know. yeah, we got married a few months ago. And yeah, we signed a paper. We signed a paper. It's Facebook official. Hong Kong government official too. Yeah. So yeah, we wanted to fill you guys in on a few life updates. The best way to do it would be to ask you guys questions over on Instagram and we answer these questions. What do you want to know about us? Here are all of your questions. Today. What do you want to know about Mr. and Mrs. Pitt? Mr. Oh, by the way, can I ask you my first question? You, so so after, someone's already asked it. Oh. When are you going to, did you change your name? Oh yes, are you going to change your name? Sorry. Georgia Kate Pitt. That's, that sounds beautiful. Torres Gordon. Okay, I changed my name Gordon, to you. Gordon Hong Yao. I changed my name to you? Yes, I, I take your, you take mine. Oh. <laughs> to trade. Well, I didn't know. Who does that? People do it. Some people do it. <laughs> but I, I just can't be bothered to change name. Especially, like, I travel all the time. And every time, like, for example, you go to America and stuff and you fill out the custom form, yeah. they actually have you change your name before. It's like you go through all this insane <coughs> immigration policy. How about it. you don't change your lead year, but you change your YouTube channel? To <laughs> Torres Gordon. Then it's not a kerfuffle. There's no immigration. Torres they, Gordon. They're just so confused wait, why this Asian guy, this guy called guy Torres Gordon. Called Torres Gordon. Comment down below. Okay, let me know, guys. Taurus Golden or Georgia Pitt? And, and for your for your reference, I haven't changed my name as of yet. It's just also been so complicated with like paperwork and everything. I will get around to it eventually, one day. Oh. And also, I also don't know what to be called. Should I be Georgia Kate Gordon or Georgia Maybe Kate just... Gordon Pitt or Georgia Kate Pitt or Georgia Pitt? Like, what do I do? Maybe just change your name at once. <laughs> just become Samantha. Okay, Karen. Bao Lian. Bao Lian. Bao Lian Pitt. Be bowling. But that's kind of the uh -huh. restaurant name that I would love to go to. Okay, next question. Congratulations. Is this even a question? Thank you. Thank you. Yes. Yes. No, thank, thank you so much. Thank you. There was such an outpouring of love from everyone. Yeah. And we really appreciate it. So yeah. thank you guys for that. <laughs> oh, can I just tell you the funniest thing? So when you go to the wedding registry, so I went there, wedding registry, signed the paper at the Hong Kong official registry place. So we sat down, guess what's the first thing they asked us? But I don't see football! It's like I did not see that coming. I thought, oh wow, it's a beautiful like sort of church. It's government place, but I thought maybe they would be like, wow, congratulate this like newly wet. But I don't see football. Consumption voucher is okay. <laughs> no, my favorite thing is when you went to register to register, you have to register oh. two weeks in advance. Then like they, there's like this really formal uh, policeman and then he was like are you guys doing this by your own free will? Do you want to get married to each other? Are you guys cousins? <laughs> cousins. <laughs> we were like, clearly not. Did you and Taurus get a prenup? And how did you work that out? I, I started my career after meeting Georgie. So everything I have got, we got it together. Oh, babe, that's so sweet. Yeah, I wouldn't be here without you. I think maybe it's kind of different for us because we met when we were so young and we've like grown up together. Uh, it's practical. Especially people with people that are more practical, like mm. it makes sense. But for us, YOLO. <laughs> YOLO. <laughs> okay, next question. It's a trap. What? Uh? The person literally wrote, it's a trap. <laughs> it's a trap for you or it's a trap for me, the wedding? No, the marriage. Wait. Marriage, wedding, trap. There's a Cantonese thing saying, YOLO TAN CHONG ZI BAI Yeah. So it's like you become a husband and you're trapped for, the, for life. How do you define the right timing to get married? Uh, I think sometimes you just feel like it. And then... Just some days you're like, yeah, I'll feel like it. <laughs> and then the diamond price is good, good. I couldn't propose to Georgie because my life was not stable. Country hopping, city hopping, plane hopping every few days. There's no way we could get married like that. Those were the times we were like trying to build our career, trying to make content. So, couldn't. And then we did that for two years and I thought, hmm, it's getting more stable now. Or I foresee it's gonna get stable in a few months. Mm. So then I proposed. Okay, so uh, it's different for a man though. Because I feel like it's often the girl, when I, look at, when I look at my friends' relationships, it's often the girl that's like more, like waiting to be proposed to. Yeah. So when does a man decide, okay, you know what, I'm gonna start like thinking about getting engaged, thinking about marriage? Financially. 
You want to be financially stable. Yeah. For example, I'm always like, oh, I want four <laughs> babies. And it's like, ah, I don't care. I'm going to have four babies. And then Tori starts going like this to me. He put, brings up the calculator. He's like, one baby's tuition times four equals plus. And he just makes it seem uh, like it costs like. Yeah. And interest rate is high now. Yeah. A lot of people ask me, like, am I pregnant? Because I guess they, they it just appeared that we just did the signing. Yeah. And to answer your question, we actually have some very good news. Uh, no baby, no baby. Yeah, but maybe soon. Who knows? Oh. <laughs> now. A few moments later. Oh, your hair is a little bit. <laughs> your hair is. Next question. Yeah. When is the wedding? Oh my god. We've decided after much thought and consideration that we are not having a wedding. Damn. 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 No, it's honestly, we went back and forth so many times. Like, do we have a huge wedding and invite everyone? Or do we just have like really close friends? But then you know you're gonna like insult some people. And it's just like, where do we plan it? And like, we were traveling so much and to plan a wedding, it requires yes. so much time and energy. I think, uh, especially difficult for me and Georgie because she's from South Africa, I'm from Hong Kong. So these two places are so far from each other and our family from both Places decided now we are gonna have Taurus's family, yeah. his immediate family fly to South Africa with my immediate family, and we're gonna have just like a few day celebration yeah. of our wedding. Yeah. And that's that's all we wanted really. It's like just to spend time with our family, have something very uh, small and intimate, and let less pressure. Like the stress of planning a wedding. Anyone that's planned a wedding, I honestly like give you a round of applause because it's so stressful. Yeah, and I think. Like when we were thinking about it, I just made sure I was thinking like, am I not, if I don't do have a wedding, will I, will I regret it in 10 years time? I think you have to critically think about what you're trying to do. And as long as that's what you want, then do it. Mm. And it's, you just have to follow your own path. I mean, wedding is about you. If you think, well, all these organizing and everything is still complicated. Okay, last question. How often do you do naughty things? To end the video, I got one question for yeah, you. Yeah. What do you hope our life looks like in 10 years time? What do people do when they're 36? I don't know. I don't know. I hope we'll still be healthy, our parents are healthy, and then we're still maybe with a Hello? little kid of ours and then we what? can travel around. Or someone we adopt or multiple kids. Multiple kids. Like we don't know what's gonna happen. And this is the fun of That's our true. lives. Alright guys, thanks so much for watching and thanks for following along our journey since the day that we started making videos and dating and now engaged and now married. Thanks for watching guys. Alright. Stay tuned for the next video. Ciao, Bella. We love you.